I think the important thing with financial service organizations is really at the moment we're at a war, we're all fighting for all the customers out there. So the reality is that we've moved away from being uh, traditional and expecting the, the business to come in as it used to be and now have to be more competitive but at, at the same time more relevant both to the customer and to our employees. And the only way to do that and reinvent ourselves and be refreshed is actually through innovating what we do. One of the things that's obvious is really around the technological advancement and uh, both from a consumer point of view and, and from ourselves as financial institutions. And by that I mean that more and more our customers are demanding to be more self-serviced. Uh, at the same time, they want the high-end services. So some of the trends are more around mobile technology, uh, the trends around accessibility. So you have to be able to reach uh, our consumers. Uh, and uh, the 24-hour service capability, the expectation that you have to be there for me 24 hours a day as a banker. And at the same time, you have to have the things that I need. You have to simplify your products and you have to be transparent about your pricing. And that's really some of the challenges, but also opportunities that we're seeing right now. The award we won is really around access banking, which is creating access to uh, communities that are previously unbanked. Uh, the business I run has 7 million customers of the 10 million Standard Bank customers. So the award is absolutely amazing because it actually doesn't belong to us as an institution. It's an acknowledge acknowledgement of that customer base. It's basically saying that that man in the blue overalls, that nurse, that teacher who's commuting and traveling 50 kilometers away from the branch network can have access to banking in their communities. And I think that's an accolade because it's saying that you can take innovative um, technology and you can create accessibility in a way that uh, you include more and more people who were previously unbanked. And if you look at South Africa and the South African market, uh, where we've got actually 22 million South Africans who earn less than, uh, let's say, $300, majority of those are bank in the community, majority of those are not necessarily available during bank hours, and the innovation that we created, that we've won, is really technology-enabled, where we can acquire an account um, inside in community, partnering with the mom and pop shops, which are the spatza shops, to create banking uh, for the people in a way that allows them to transact, uh, to engage in the financial services in a previously, uh, what I call previously high-end bank. Uh, they're now part of it in a simplified product. Uh, there are no monthly fees. But at the heart of it, we couldn't have been able to do this without the technology. So you've taken technology, you've taken banking, you've created accessibility, and you've empowered the consumer in a dignified manner. I think the BAI Finical Innovation Awards, the Global Awards, uh, bring credibility. It's a retail banking award. It's the industry acknowledging some of the technology and innovation around us. Uh, there are quite a few out there which are technological based, which are platform based. But this one is saying it's for us. It's from a banking point of view. It's saying we understand our consumer. And it, it's got the significance, it's got the prestige. I mean, when I do go back home, for example, we are gonna make a big deal about it because we've gotta create awareness to say that we've got the award because we've been acknowledged for being relevant to the customer. And at the heart of it, it's really about being the customer. And I think the, the BAI uh, Global Award really is about that. It's about saying what's the innovation that's transforming how we serve our customers in the banking sector and at the same time shifting the reputation around banking to take it away from what might have been an exclusive uh, reach to all the way down to create accessibility. And if you, when you, if you start providing awards in the retail sector that reach the unbanked, it means that actually from a banking industry, the BAI is saying we're no longer an elitist um, uh, a sector. We're actually about every single person and we're about the customer. And quite frankly, I think they've had a fantastic run for three years. It's becoming more and more aspirational. And for us to have won the award, we're absolutely ecstatic and we'll make a lot of noise about it. You know, all the award winners were interesting because all of us are incorporating technology with the, with the interesting trends around the customer. So if you think about it, every single one of the, or the categories and the winners coming out of that had an element of their innovation that is useful to, to any one of us. If I take the example from Korea and the one-click mortgage, um, that's fantastic as a tool. And it's fantastic because it's saying you can actually create a very simplified, very efficient, a very customer-friendly uh, offering that allows your customers to get that first home, access to that first home hassle-free without all the paperwork that comes along. And if you look at, is it Kaiser Bank in Spain? Um, my goodness, they've taken innovation in the retail side to a different level. They've said, actually, we need to stop thinking as a bank. We need to think 
completely from a consumer and a customer point of view and constantly question uh, what can we do differently and that's the same logic that we apply so if I take any one of those examples at the different levels within the bank we can apply any of that technology and I think actually that's probably one of the secrets of the BAI retail global awards because if you look at it uh, it creates synergy so there's no reason why coming out of the session I can't pick up the phone and call the guys in Korea or the guys in Spain and say can we have a conversation about the innovation that you won and vice versa there's no reason why they can't pick up the phone and call us and say how can we actually implement some of the, the technology that you've applied out there and at the heart of it it's not really just about the technology which is why again the BAI retail awards are critical because it's about combining the core of what banking is about retail banking and saying what are the needs of the customer and how do we, tra how we, tra how do we transition from being traditional to being relevant in a very technological manner.